Alright, yo, what is going on, guys? It's Jimmo here, known as Cloud Master Jimmo. In today's video, I will be showing you guys how to USB mod um, Call of Duty World at War on Xbox only. This is for Xbox, but I don't know if you can do it on PS3, but all I know that you can do it on Xbox. This is why, like, previous video that I previously made about Smokies XKLVX non host menu USB V2. And today I will be showing you guys how to USB mod World of War Zombies with Horizon. The first application that you will need to be on your computer to use this, and it's not like you just put the USB, the save game data straight onto the root of the USB. It's not going to work because you need to be to put it onto a um, a profile. So first of all, you need to get your USB, which I have it right here, but. Um, First of all, I'm just going to show you what you need to do. So, all your make sure you have a like your profile on your USB because all these these are like my profiles on Xbox. So, first of all, you need one of them. Okay, so let's go ahead and open up Horizon, and I'll leave a link in the description, guys, of Horizon, and I'll leave that in the description. And uh, yeah, we'll just wait for this to load up. It's not going to show on the screen, but it's going to show on my first screen. Uh, my first monitor because it's you know just to make sure you have your Xbox on at the same time as well because this is what I have my Xbox on right now so wait a minute where's my controller so it's currently that time right now and I've not signed in yet so let's get back to my computer <clears throat> uh, alright there we go got the notification said it's horizons opening so bear with me just one sec guys okay here we go now we've got horizon so first of all you don't need to sign in but well I've already signed in but previously but I don't need it right now okay so as, as it says you've got your USB flash drive make sure you got it in there'll be a link in the description for this so there's your games you go to here and I've got my Call of Duty World of War and it's right there and I've got my game saves and it's got my profile gamer tags and this is the one I'll be on right now Call Master Jimmo's account and that's the game save right there the USB menu so let's go ahead and show you how to do this so bear with me I'm just going to get the the, um, the download and I'm going to get the the file for the USB menu so yeah be right back okay so as you can tell I have the um, once I downloaded it you will have this this will, will pop up I find this really funny this image like for real I laughed at it <laughs> you just put it in it's pretty cool like <laughs> still no pickles <laughs> right there you go there's SVG which is the USB so you just pretty much just drag it in just wait for it to load and uh, you just minimize that down so as you can tell you got all of them here so first of all all you need to do, you do is go to here where it says change then you go to the profile that you want to do it on just to bear in mind guys do not do it on your normal profile because I'm not I'm not gonna be responsible of your account getting banned so if I were you get account that has already been banned or the account you not play on and just use that one so I'm gonna click on there and click manage and if, it's this, if your profile is not showing up, all you need to do is click manage and then you'll see the drop down menu. Well, you'll see this and you just tick favorite on each one or the profile that you want to use. So I clicked on this one and you just click it, click off that and it will show up in here. Well, it didn't. And then you just click it again. And there we go. Oh, it's already on. There we go. So first of all, all you need to do now is go to contents. You go here. There's the SVG. You go save, rehash, and resign. Say OK. And you go to your flash drive. Save to device. Flash drive. Say yes. And then say yes again because I've already done this. And it would only come out with two notifications, not three, because I done this already. But I'm doing it all over again. Okay. So you just press OK. Cross that off and I'll meet you guys on the Xbox okay now we are on the Xbox all you need to do wait before one sec 
and before you take out first of all go down the drop down auto and go to your USB uh, go to here and just right click it come on and then you just click eject and just wait for it to say it's done yep there you go now you safely take out your USB and you safely put it into your Xbox wherever your doesn't matter what Xbox it is you don't need to be a new one or an old one just plug it in where it, is, where it goes okay that's my USB in and let's cross off Horizon because you don't need that anymore and let's go into my Xbox okay now we are on the Xbox so we need to wait for this uh, to show all the profiles because it should restart and just give it a second for your Xbox to recognize there's a USB in your Xbox so it's already done that and now just need to wait for it to uh, show that it's it should go down to zero profiles and it goes back up to how many you've got so be right back okay as you can tell now we've got my um, profile there and let me just click on my gamer tag but this account has been banned, it's a permanent ban, so I don't actually give a flying shit. Or I don't give a flying fuck. Sorry. But, right, let's get right into the video, and as you can tell, I'm banned, but... So, so now you've got your USB in your Xbox, and that's my USB on... That's my profile on my USB, and let's just load up World of War. I just supposed to like makes a racket. <laughs> Meh. Alrighty. And now you should get a notification what storage device it should go to, like your hard drive or your USB. So obviously you just press start button. And it should come up like this. I know this was like ages ago. I was a young kid since I put my fucking hard drive, my fucking oh, maybe it's not. Okay, so first of all, click USB. I know it says it's there because I've already done this, but yeah. So you go to the solo, Rusalem game, Rusalem game, sorry. And you just wait for it. And it just loads this. And you just wait until like the little wee line down at the bottom of your screen. You can see that line, just wait until that's all gone. I am done. And you spam B button. So that's what I'm doing right now. And then once it should kick you out. Don't let it load, just keep pressing B button and it kicks you out of the game. Well, sorry my car. Okay, now once you press start, it should have in the bottom in the message of your day message box, it should say Smokey X KLVX V2 infected. Hard. Right. Hope you enjoy this US insane USB mod menu. It is fucking insane. So that's how you done, that's it done, and I'll show you that it 100% works. And don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and if you found this video very helpful. Don't forget to share this video and share it to your friends and share it to everywhere that you wherever you want to share it to. And click that subscribe button, it's red, but then it'll change to grey. Have a try, you'll see. And leave a like, you know, go blue. That's what I want. So, first of all, how to open up the menu is by pressing back button. And there you go. There's the mod menu. There's the awful, so you got god mode, you got your gamer tags, you got the visions, you got prestige, and game of host, take call, clan tags, and force host. So that's actually pretty sweet to have in a non-host menu. So, let's go and game of host. So pretty much it kills the server. Pretty much, it's pretty cool. I like that. And it comes back to here. Nothing happens. It just does that. Kicks everybody out of the game. But I'm banned, so I can't really do this online. But yeah, if you want to try it on your main account, don't blame me that your account has got banned because I told you to do it. But I'm just saying, it's up to you. Don't do it. Just saying, just don't put it on your main account because you're just gonna get your account banned. Just like what you see here. But well, yeah, and then I'll show you the main mods. I've made a showcase on this. If you'd like to see the showcase on this non, 
on this non-house USB mod menu. There will be a link in the description uh, for the video, my video, and I'll leave a link in the description for the USB menu, the download to it, and download to the Horizon menu. And uh, yeah, shout out is a fucking match. And thank you to SmokeyXKillVX, big thanks to him. I'll leave his channel in the description, big thanks to him, because he's... I cannot do this tutorial without X Smokey to do this, because he made a tutorial of how to USB mod this game, and I got instantly confused, and I don't know how to do it, and I found him, made a tutorial, I loved it, and he did it well, and pretty much just go to his channel and say thanks to him, because that pretty much helped me uh, to get this USB menu, and yeah. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share this video if you like, if you find it helpful. And yeah, peace out everybody. Oh, oh yeah, die, by the way, you'll get D-pad binds, D-pad left, turns on God mode, and your LB button, no clip obviously, and pretty much like drop weapons, reload, which is up on the D-pad, don't know what, right button, right D-pad should open up the scoreboard that's like online if you want to do online or not but yeah i would advise not to but it's up to you so yeah hope you enjoyed please leave a like comment subscribe and i know i said this already mm, peace out